Yo, what's going on guys? Elmet Games here, back with another video, and in today's video, I'm going to be over something that I'm a bit late to. Well, I'm not going to say a bit, I'm pretty late to it. An entire day's worth late. Um, I just wanted to explain um, what's on the screen here right now. We've got this, this, this boy, this boy, this, this guy looks super cool. We've, we've got the Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, um, new unit that's coming out. And... This guy, um, his art looks really cool. Um, his TUR art is actually a little bit different than I would have thought. It looks a little bit of a different style than I um, expected it to be. I mean, <clears throat> I, it's kind of weird because like no one expected the Super Saiyan 4 um, Gogeta out of nowhere like this. Like it was more, people were more expecting it for more of potential anniversary or like maybe the next the, um, worldwide celebration type thing. No one was expecting him just as a normal TUR, not even an LR, just out of nowhere like this. And this is such a surprising thing that I didn't have time to save any stone for um, this with this guy. And I mean that's fine because um, I I don't I don't plan on summoning um, straight up. I don't plan on summoning. I plan on saving my stones until the um, until the six year anniversary so that I can make some very good content once that comes out. Like, above and beyond. I don't want to summon like no little amount of crystals on this Gogeta banner when and then when I can just summon like nearly a thousand stones on the anniversary and then just have way more content. Hopefully maybe even get a rainbow or something, you know. That would be my first rainbow um LR for anybody. I'm close for some but not not quite. So that those would be my if the six year anniversary LRs were the units I, I'd rainbow first, I'd be happy obviously. Because it's looking like it's going to be MUI Goku and Evolution Blue Vegeta and like I just keep thinking it like imagine just pulling that SSR art of some I don't know if it's going to be a base Goku or whatever and then you just knowing he goes into this Ultra Instinct Goku it'd be so hype it'd be so hype although I feel like Omen Goku looks a bit better um I gotta say MUI Goku still looks cool like he still looks really good and then Evolution Blue Vegeta don't even get me started about him the um the blue the different type of blue color it looks it's sick but that's besi that, that's besides the um, topic of this video obviously Gogeta so um Gogeta here this isn't an HD um scan I don't think we've gotten those yet unless we have I mean it's later in the day now so there's a chance but I expect it more later like tomorrow maybe um later tonight we get like HD scans but we've got this um yeah we've got this Gogeta so this right here you can kind of see it is the SSR art and then this is the um, TUR art and then you have that along with this is I'm pretty sure explaining a new um, story event which is gonna um, talk about of a GT Vegeta a free-to-play GT Vegeta that might end up going into like a great ape into a Super Saiyan 4 or something could be interesting as a free-to-play unit um, like I said though I'm not really like the only I'm the only thing I'm gonna be doing with the celebration. I'll grind the free to play unit, of course, and then I'll just kind of just go with the flow with the celebration um, because I don't, I, I yeah I don't I don't I don't plan on on summoning. It's such a weird thing to say yes, but I actually I legit just don't plan on summoning because um, you guys heard my reasons for the anniversary. Um, when I saw the uh, info. Not info. When I saw the scan for Gogeta, one of the things I first thought was I was thinking, what EZA would come out of the celebration? And obviously, it, the what makes the most sense is the Super Saiyan fours. And if that's the case, I didn't think we were gonna get the Super Saiyan four EZA so early. I did not think we were. I don't think it's gonna be both of them. I personally think it's gonna be Vegeta because even though Goku is more in need, Vegeta has more of a, um, a tie to the celebration because. First of all, the story event has to do with the GT Vegeta, so that makes more sense. Second of all, um, the Goku's from the Baby Saga, and the Vegeta's actually from the Shadow Dragon Saga, so I think it makes more sense for um, for Vegeta to get his EZA with this, when in terms of the celebration. They could always do Goku, I mean, it doesn't matter, but I think it makes more sense for Vegeta if we're talking about in terms of the celebration, um, the celebration info, the cel well, not info, the celebration, um, what's the word? I don't know. The theme, the theme of the celebration. Um, Alongside that, I'm assuming this Gogeta will lead some, well, I can't even say new category because they didn't do that with Frieza, so there's there's not a guarantee. And he, he I hope he leads Shadow Dragon Saga, makes the team a bit better, I hope. Fingers crossed. 
um, this Gogeta is probably gonna have some fire OST. He's gonna, um, what's it called? The Gogeta is probably going to have fire animations. Like, it's gonna be so tempting to summon, but I know, but like, I, I'm gonna stick by it. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna save for the uh, six year so that I can, um, make really good content during the six year. And I, I have hopes that, um, the six year anniversary will will improve from the fit five year anniversary and the worldwide download celebration which was just kind of lacking in content and i hope that they will fix on that during the sixth year and hopefully implement some new like a new game mode or something to make the game seem fresh again um chain battle's cool but they gotta um fix that that's another video i'm going to make soon um actually probably in this sitting like maybe right after this or something um yeah so short video for, of course short video of course but yeah, just wanted to say we got the Super Saiyan 4 um, Gogeta coming out. Uh, for most people, this is a must summon because everyone loves Gogeta. And on uh, normal situations, if this was like where like Kefla was at, then I would have definitely um, summoned. But um, in this case, when the anniversary is getting kind of close, I just want to save as much stones as I can right now. And um, speaking of Kefla, Kefla should be on this banner, which is good for most people because I'm assuming most people didn't summon on her banner because her banner was trash. I did, but, um, and I got her, so I'm not worried about that. But, um, anyway, if you guys enjoyed and you want to see more news, things like this, please let me know in the comments if you'd like to, um, to see more news info. It might be a little bit harder getting it out because I have to go to school now, and, um, with school, there's in the way of the day. This is the reason I couldn't do this video so early, because I was at school the entire day, and it came out while I was at school. I saw it on my phone. Well, it came out in the early in the morning, but I saw it at school. And, um, yeah, so that, that's pretty much it. Um, there is, um, one little, I guess one last thing to say. I'm pretty sure Dragon Ball Legends is getting a Metal Cooler Vegeta and a new Metal Cooler. With, I'm pretty sure in the V-Jump scan, it was, actually, we probably look for it here somewhere. It, it, they've gotta have it here somewhere. Yeah, right here. So they have this, like, Vegeta. It's, like I said, it's not HD quality, so you're not gonna see much. But yeah, they have this Vegeta, and I heard that he has like some type of special super attack or something with Goku. Um, I don't know how that how interesting that would be. And then we also have this Metal Cooler, which as if you can see here, this is the same art that the AGL SS, the SSR of the AGL Metal Cooler and Dokkan has. So I love that art. So that's really cool. And Lineage, uh, look at that Supernova. That Supernova looking huge. But yeah, um, Lineage Re Evil needs some new stuff. So this is what we got. Um, like I said, if you want to see more news videos like this, just let me know. Uh, I'll try to do them more often if that's the case. Um, got a lot of more videos planned uh, for the next couple of days. And then also, obviously, um, me personally, I have a second channel video um, planned for this week as well. A uh, new gacha game that I haven't played on the channel yet. Or just haven't played on this channel either. So, um, yeah. Hope that, that'll be fun. Hope you stay tuned for that. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.